Welcome to Daxus. We have some good news for you. You don't need to be an expert to keep your bike ready for anything that might come your way. Here are a few things to go over and be mindful of before heading out. Start by visually inspecting your tyres for nicks, cuts, cracks and any other bold spots. To ease the inspection of the back wheel, you can balance the bike on its stand while spinning the wheel. Ensure that the front wheel is tightened properly. If satisfied, check the tyre pressure with a pressure gauge. And if necessary, inflate or deflate that tyre to around 80% of the recommended pressure as stated on the tyre's side wall. For a maximum load, maximum pressure is recommended. This is your controller. It has the power switch, two speed changing buttons, plus and minus, the front light switch on the right and the display mode switch on the left. Pushing the plus button will lend more assistance to your pedaling, allowing you to reach higher speeds. The minus button reduces the level of assistance, therefore reducing your speed. Holding down the minus button while riding will put the bike into cruise mode, maintaining the speed at the moment of pressing it. Holding your finger down on the minus button will activate your bike's walk mode. This is a fully automated mode. It has a cap speed of 6 to 7 km per hour, minimizing the effort you need to expend when you need to push your bike instead of riding it. Each PAS, pedal assist system, has a capped top speed. Battery levels also affect the top speed. Next, turn on your electronic display by pressing the power button on the controller for 2 seconds. Check the front light by pressing the front light button on the controller. For added safety in traffic, you may want to keep your front light on even during daylight hours. Adjust the saddle to your hip height and make sure it's secured tightly. It's vital to ensure that both your back and your front brakes are fully functioning before setting out. To test them, push your bike forward and squeeze the left brake lever to test the rear brake. Then, repeat with the right brake lever to test the front brake. Is everything in order? Then, put on your helmet and enjoy your ride.